I really want Nintendo, and I know they're not gonna do it. I want Shy Guy to have his own game. They gave Toad his own game with Captain Toad. Why not Shy Guy? You know, Shy Guy could have like a. What could Shy Guy do? He can. This is gonna be me at the, the uh, at Nintendo trying to pitch this idea, and they'd be like, "Okay, all right, Shy Guy, and what can Shy Guy do? What do you want this Shy Guy game to be about?" Uh, Shy Guy. Uh, <laughs> uh Shy Guy. Okay, Shaga. <laughs> he could. Okay, let me let me be serious. Shaga could be like. I know you guys hear that, right? It isn't just me, is it? Put the power block up there. Oh, I got his card. Oh, I want to check out the power block though. See how it is in this game. Hey, Diamond, my dog is just came running in my room, looking right at me like I'm supposed to go and turn the thunder off. <laughs> she came in here like, "Oh, you gonna keep that thunder on all day?" <laughs> okay, it just stuns them. Hang on, damn it, what can the Shy Guy do? If Shy Guy had a game, what what should he do, Diamond? What, Diamond? What? 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 Damn. Diamond said that Shy Guy should go on. Okay. It's gotta be different. Um, that's what I'm trying to, that's what making it hard to like figure out. It's gotta be different from Mario, right? It can't be like the same old thing. Like, like Luigi, his own game, it is so different from Mario. You know, his whole game mechanic is different. It plays different. Toad plays different. Uh, so if Shy Guy's gonna have his own game, then he's gotta do something different. So what is he gonna do? I was thinking maybe it's kind of hard because Mario can do so many things. I mean, you know, Mario is a simple game, but if you think about it, Mario can do a lot of stuff, especially when he get the power ups. And this is why I say it because I was thinking maybe Mario. I mean, maybe Shy Guy. You play a Shy Guy, and you can, you know, he got his old. He can, he can jump. He can run fast. And I was thinking maybe he could take off his mask and throw it. But then, like, that will kind of, like, ruin the character of Shy Guy, right? Because, like, you know, we don't we don't see Shy Guy take off his mask. But I was kind of, I was thinking, like, he could, like, I don't know, throw something. Maybe, okay, how about this? Sometimes when you got a character like that, an object is given to them so they can help them out, right? So maybe at the start of the game, of a Shy Guy game, Okay, how about this? We have it open world like. It's an open world Mario world game, right? You know what I mean? Like it's the world is Mario. You know how Mario lives in a completely different world. Uh, you know, everything looks weird and stuff like that. So, we put Shy Guy in that world, but it's open world. Not not like Ah, uh, man, I really want this Shy Guy game so bad, but I don't know how I wanted to play like I don't know, Shy Guy. Can I run away? Good man. I was thinking maybe like Shy Guy could. 
Okay, well, hang on. Let me, let me, okay, I'm thinking about I'm thinking about the game too much. I'm thinking at too many ideals at the same time. First, what should the game be about? Okay, how about it could be about a one you play as one random shy guy? Okay, this the reason you play as this shy guy is because he's doing his thing, you know, with the other shy guys or whatever, you know, marching in line or whatever they do. And something comes and hit him in the head. Bow! Knocks him out. The other shot guy, they don't know what to do. They just kind of like look at him and then they just move on. Uh, and what hit him in the head was maybe like a boomerang or something like that. Or something that he could like throw and come back to him. Uh, that could be like the game mechanic. He can like pretty much do the same thing as Mario but just throw something as if you playing a Mario game but the whole time he's in his boomerang suit right I mean would that really be so bad it's got to be something else that shy guy could do well you know shy guy coming like shy, every single time we see a shy guy he's always doing something different got something on got some different equipment he's either flying or got a mask on so maybe the you know he can put on there's different elements of the game where he gotta put on different gadgets to get past certain spots so it's gonna be a platformer and uh, open world I kind of want a Mario open world game. I'm not going to lie. I mean, Odyssey, I wouldn't count that as an open world. That's like open levels. It's big. It's levels, but they're just big. They make it feel like, you know, obviously it's not open world, obviously. But with Shy Guy, it can be in this sort of style, too. This is X style. Not the gameplay, but it can look like this, right? Not flat, not paper, you know, style, but just like, you know, 3D, open world. Here's a temple that we're in. Uh, you know, you know what I mean? <laughs> uh, what else? So, so far, let me think about it. So far, we got an open world Shy Guy game in a Mario reality. Okay. He's got the element of, well, he's got the gameplay element of a throw, like he can throw something and knock something out. The object can come back to him. He's got the different gadgets that you see Shy Guy using. Um, we want it to be a platformer and open world game. Okay, but what is the goal? Huh. Well, since Mario... Since Mario really likes stars. And stuff like that. Why not have it so that the object that hit Shy Guy in the head is a star? Right? It's a star that falls from the sky. It's like a Rosalina. Okay, like, alright, we're gonna have two characters. Not a play ass, but like Rosalina's in the store. Uh, right? Oh, you mother. Oh, he almost got me, didn't he? He almost got me to cuss. <laughs> oh, man. He made me so mad when he did that. Um, made me lose my train of thought. Rosalina. Rosalina, one of her star children, has, like, fell from the sky. Right? And, like... And like, uh, how are you not dead? Okay. He's dead now. Okay, so basically, Rosalina, one of her star children fell from the sky. Okay. And it hit this shot guy on the head. Now, before I go on, I got a question. Is shot guy, like, I always say that shot guy is like a, he's like a, uh, force of nature. I don't think Shy Guy know what he's doing. He, he doesn't really know right from wrong. Some Shy Guys do, but this Shy Guy, he's not all that smart like the other intelligent Shy Guys. He, so he doesn't really know right from wrong. He's like a force of nature just coming through, you know? And I want this Shy Guy to get hit in the head with this star. 
Uh. Okay. Okay, go around. I want this shit I gotta get hit in the head with a star. This star is the boomerang. Like, it's not a boomerang. I'm saying he can use it like a boomerang. He can, like, throw the star and it can come back to him. It can talk to him or whatever. Because they love objects like this to come out and talk to you. So, that's what we're gonna do. Uh. Mario, how do we get back up there? I don't know. I might have to go back and come back in. Yeah. Is it moving? Yeah. So, and the whole the whole object of the game, objective of the game, is to get the star back to Rosalina. <laughs> like Rosalina, too lazy to come down and pick it up herself. <laughs> Well, that's the thing about Mario games. You're not you're not supposed to think about it too much, because it's you know it's a game for children. You know it's supposed to be silly and wacky. You're not supposed to think about it too much. Uh. So like, okay. Let me think now. So your objective is to bring the star back. You you go on an adventure. You know this open world adventure where you meet all these wacky uh, Mario characters. Um, let me, oh, uh-oh, um, yeah, but you playing as Shy Guy, and, like, some people don't like Shy Guy, and so you gotta try and, like, uh, like, some people might not want to talk to you, but, like, or run away from you, and so you gotta, like, try and prove that you're, you're, uh, you know, good, you gotta build up your reputation. I'm not saying, like, that's, like, a... A second main point of the game or mechanic no it's not like a reputation meter or anything like that it's just like uh, don't you do it no oh I knocked it out go ah uh, it's like that makes no sense why'd you do that okay I gotta kill you Alright, so like... Mm, I'm just gonna run away, because they're gonna disappear if I run away. Oh, come on, Mario. So, but it's like, if you wanna... Like, if you try to pick up a side quest or something like that, and someone don't like a shy guy, then you don't have to like do something for them. Like you have to like prove that you're not gonna hurt them or something like that. So like, let's say, hmm, what'd be a good example? Let's say you're playing a game and you're in the woods or something, and then you make it out the woods and you see like this little town or village or whatever, and you wanna, hmm, what do you wanna do? You can like shops and stuff. Uh, hmm. You can like Well it's just like for side quests So If you well, I better save well, Why is he Oh Why is that one red oh, Okay So basically like Maybe you just want to talk to him and see what's wrong with him. Let's say like, you go into town and he... He's one of those spike guys that just fell off. I don't know what he called. Let's say it's, it's him and he's like being attacked by enemies or something like that. And he sees you and he tells you, to, Go away, I don't want to talk to a shy guy. I'm going to pull you up. Alright. Well, oh, that was a close call. Uh, you better be looking at the game. You better you be looking at the game over screen if it wasn't for me. All right. Hey, look over there. 
<laughs> yeah. How are we gonna get over there? I don't know. Better think of something. Yeah, let's forget about the paint stars. We've got to. What are we going to do about this lava? It's rising. Okay. Go! Is that gonna stop us? Oh no! This don't look like we're gonna make it. Mario. This don't look like we're gonna make it. <laughs> Just don't. This had to be a, I mean, that red star is already gone. Yep. Okay. Well, you know, basically you have to like take out the enemies or something like that to save the, the god, the NPC's life. And then maybe he'll be more open to talk to you. Okay, go. Uh, Mario? Okay. Whew. What? Game over. <laughs> I guess you didn't have what it takes.